Good morning guys, what is happening, what's going on, what is good, welcome back to another reaction video. Guys, we seem to be on a roll with like female fronted bands, which in my personal opinion, I think is pretty dope, you know what I mean? Uh, today we are doing Poppy. Now, I remember Poppy when she used to do those seriously, seriously weird uh, videos where she'd be like, Hi, my name's Poppy. And all that kind of, like it was just the strangest thing I think anyone had ever seen on YouTube. Uh, and my cousin sent me a video of Poppy and I was like, oh man, she's weird. And he's like, no, no, no. She does music. She does metal now. And I was like, what the hell? And she seems to be quite successful in doing her metal videos. We've got 3 million, 3.4 million, 9 million views, 3 million. Like, she's doing a lot, dude. So I thought, screw it. Let's, let's get into this, man. So today we're going to be doing Poppy's X. Uh, 9.1 million views released November 5th, 2018. I'm pretty interested to see what this is going to be like because she went, she was like this really good, good, good girl and now she's into metal. So, yeah, I don't know what to think of that, but let's figure it out, man. Guys, before I get into this, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Let's try and aim for, because this is completely new, I'm going to aim low. Let's try and get 7,000, just kidding. Uh, let's try and get maybe like 100 views, uh, 100 views, 100 likes. Uh, smash that comment section down below as well, guys. It would be greatly appreciated. The more you guys engage with my videos, my channel has seen a significant improvement. All like in my analytics, it went from like reds to greens, which, which is sick, man. Uh, but I've been releasing videos a lot. Uh, but yeah, so whenever there's engagement in my videos, YouTube are like, yo, this guy's doing pretty well. Let's take them up. People are actually digging this video. So yeah, it would help so much. Make sure you smash that subscribe button as well, guys. Uh, new content very, very regularly, usually like three to four times a week. And follow me on Instagram as well. would be greatly appreciated, guys. Uh, right, let's get into this. Poppy's X. What the hell? That is one of the weirdest switches I've ever heard in my life. Now it's pop. Now it's legit pop. I'm not hating it. Holy crap. Bro. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell, man? I'm giving this a like right now. So this is some kind of cult. I love this. It's so catchy. What is going on? This is so strange.
You know, I feel like I've been brainwashed and I'm in a cult now. Bro, <laughs> this is the kind of stuff that they show you before you're being brainwashed into getting into a cult. I swear to God, it is the strangest, most horrific, horrific, horrifying, but amazing things I've ever heard. Dude, what the f I, I don't want to swear, bro. I don't want to swear because some of these videos I'm able to monetize, so I don't want to ruin my chances of doing that. What in the world is this? I had no idea her weird videos would end up her being doing this. And I like it a lot. Right, I'm very intrigued to see what the... Mad Descent, that is Diplo's label. And Titanic Sinclair, he did all of her other weird stuff. Ah, oh, man, what the... F right. My two, personali my two personalities are... Bro, right. The amount of differences is unreal, dude. I don't get it, but I love it. How do you, how do you make such different contrasts in one song? How do you do that? What the hell, bro? Man, I don't know what to say. Because, it, like, I actually thoroughly enjoyed that so much. I just don't know what to say. I'm almost as shocked as I was first hearing um, Baby Metal's Gimme Chocolate. Like, honestly, this is the strangest thing ever. I can't believe this stuff exists. Right, let's check out the lyrics. By the way, I dug that. Everything about it, I loved. I'm just absolutely shocked. That's all. I, I'm speechless. Right. Oh, heavy... I want to love everyone, empty every bullet out of every gun. Please take me back to where we began. Get me, get me bloody. Please get me bloody. I love this part, by the way. It was so catchy. Get me, get me bloody. Please get me bloody. You can get down on your knees if you're naughty. Now, that's very sexual. I don't know if it was meant to be about blowjobs or execution. Poetry, 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 ecstasy, ecstasy, ecstasy. Maybe we can save the world from every... Evil boy and dangerous girl, please make me believe in harmony. Get me bloody, get me, get me bloody. I want to, so it just repeats, right? Let's see what this is about. Unlike Poppy's usual songs, X deals with mature subject matter. Okay, cool. X is a song about Poppy's desire to have a world peace. Okay. However, she also wishes for dark things such as violence, sex, and drugs. What? Dude, she's like 12. What the hell are you talking about? How old is Poppy, man? Twenty-five? What? Okay. Musically, the song alternates between heavy metal choruses and sunshine pop verses. Yeah, no, no crap. I was about to say that. Providing a dichotomy that was uncommon in Poppy's music at that at the time. This bi bipolar contrast is also reflected in the lyrics, with dark lyrics accompanying with heavy choruses and peaceful lyrics accompanying the lighted verses. Th this idea is furthered by the cult imagery in the video. And the way Poppy is covered in blood, it brings in mind Charles Manson's Helter Skelter scenario and his own family cult. Yeah, I got that. I got those vibes too. He viewed the hippie attitudes of the 60s as feeding directly into a conflict that wiped out most of America. The flipping back and forth between the flower power and carry on prom night versions of Poppy seem to deepen the suggestion. The acoustic version features no blood, but the band aid on Poppy's arm signifies it's still, it's still available, while also suggesting a simplicity to solutions. This is furthered by the video sterile, black and white production in very basic format. Bro! <laughs> oh my god, I need to give my cousin a big hug and a big kiss. I don't... Bro, I have to do another one of these. I have to... I thoroughly enjoyed everything about that. I thoroughly enjoyed everything about that. The video was sick, strange, weird. Her performance, she brings that like eerie... See her weird videos. She brings that eeriness and that just like... You have no idea-ness into this, but into a musical form now. So you're still like, she, she looks soulless. And I love that because it's just like, you're just like, man, I need to know more about you. 
you know, she just looks empty, dead inside. She honestly looks like she's possessed. And I love that so, so much. And she brings that so well into her performance and into the actual song as well. I am hooked. I am absolutely hooked, man. That song is so sick. I love the, give me bloody, give me, give me bloody. I love that. It's just like, you have this innocent, like, child's voice in this heavy song. And there's something about it, like, you know, in a horror film, when you're watching a horror film, I remember this so well in uh, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. I can't remember which one it was, though. They were doing Ring Around the Roses. And it is just so eerie and so scary. And it's so misplaced that it works so well. And that's what she does here. And I'm honestly, like, it's sick. It is so sick. Anyways, that is it for me. My God, I'm going to actually get into another. I'm going to do another poppy one. I don't know which one to do next. Uh, maybe I'll do concrete or I don't know. But anyways, guys, that is it for me. So until the next one, have a great day, everyone. Peace.